Add more. Wow. Big handfuls of this stuff. Just squish it around. My name is Julia Trumpy. I am the Youth Services Librarian here at the Collier Bull Birch Library. Uh, we recently started up a steam-based story time called Full Steam Ahead. The first half of it really works as a normal story time. We have a book where I introduce the concept for the day and we do a couple of rhymes and songs that go along with it. After that, we slid up into three stations, each pertaining to that topic. For instance, today we had snow, so I had like a blubber station where the children can investigate how Arctic animals keep warm with blubber uh, using Crisco and rubber gloves and ice water. Then we had a fake snow station where the children could create a homemade snow out of baking soda and either conditioner or shaving cream. And then the last station was actually painting with ice cubes, or colored ice cubes, I should say. It was frozen paint. Now, children from like two to five-year-olds, they won't always get the concept, or not at least all of it, but that's okay. A major part of this program is just to sort of help them be more aware of the world around them, ask questions. Like, my tummy is making strange sounds after I'm eating. How does that happen? Then with the activities, it sort of shows parents how they can do simple experiments with just everyday homemade things. So the story time really gives the children a great foundation of critical thinking skills that they can then carry with them throughout the rest of their lives. And in, in this day and age, science, technology, engineering, the arts and math are very, very important for like future careers or just everyday life. And you're never too young to start learning.